Welcome to my YouTube automotive channel. In today's video I have a 2020 Ford Edge and I will show you how to update the Ford Sync 3. Now this video will apply to second generation of uh, Ford Edges made from 2015 all the way up to 2024. Now I'm pretty sure that all Edges will be equipped with Ford Sync 3. If you have a 2015, you might still have a Ford Sync 2 and then the process will be completely different. I think then you have to update it by downloading, by downloading the software uh, online and then uh, inserting the USB into the port. But on these newer vehicles, Ford Sync 3, you, if, if they have Wi-Fi, you can connect to the router and update it that way. First thing you will have to do, you will have to connect your vehicle to a Wi-Fi network. To, to do that, you want to press settings, swipe to the left and press Wi-Fi here. Now, first thing you want to make sure that your Wi-Fi is turned on. And second thing, you have to be parked quite close to the router. So right now I am parked in front of my office um, and hopefully it will catch up on the network so you want to press view available networks this may take up to 10 seconds or so okay my network is to wire 484 okay perfect so I will select this and now I have to enter the password done Now this will again take a couple of seconds and okay successfully connected once that is done you want to go back and back again and you want to go automatic updates you want to press that uh, automatic system updates you want to enable this on the top Turn on automatic system updates to receive the latest available in vehicle software features, enhancement, and security updates. You will press yes. And now it will check if your system is up to date, and this sometimes can take uh, quite a while. But this is how it is done. Okay, and now I was waiting maybe for two minutes, and now it is downloading the latest update. You can see down here downloading 5U5T, blah blah blah. Yeah, and now just wait until that is done. Once, down, once it downloads the update, it will install it, then it will search for new updates again until, until it is done. So, like I said, this might take depending on how long ago you did this last time if you've never done it and you own like a 2018 19 then it might take up to one hour even i will continue this video once this is all uh done okay it's been like 20 minutes and again scanning for updates and there is another update that has to be done so that's how it works if you press here, you can see the current versions of everything, Bluetooth, Hotspot, uh, and things like that. Once all of the updates are done, at the bottom, software is up to date, you should see today's date. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much everything, that's how you do it. Thank you for watching this video. I hope it was helpful and educational. If it was, please like it and consider subscribing to my YouTube automotive channel. On my channel, there is lots of how-to videos, do-it-yourself videos, car reviews, product reviews, and other similar automotive topics.